Here we are in the man cave at the man cave bar, AKA the 2022 bar here at the Elam Estate. Today I got a new banger for you. It is the vampire juice. But before I get into that drink, I do want to point out that I am wearing a bear wolf natural fitness gear shirt. You can find these on our Facebook page, bear wolf natural fitness. This is the front logo with your bear wolf on there. And on the back, you got another design. You can check it out more thoroughly on the Facebook page. They're actually on sale right now. And also don't forget, we have our man cave experience shirts for sale and several other shirts. And anything you want to put on a shirt, we can do that as well. We can add any design you want to a shirt, front and back, under $25. So. Reach out to us, let us know if you want anything as far as that goes. But in the meanwhile, go ahead and show you how to make this vampire juice. Of course, we're gonna get our a glass of ice. I'm gonna put my sugar cube in first and I'm not going to smash it. I'm just gonna drop it in there because I like for my drinks to get sweeter towards the end. If you're watching any of my videos where I make these cocktails, you already know that, but I like to let my sugar cube dissolve instead of molding it down into the beverage. Now we're gonna take our jigger and fill it up with two ounces of Dobel tequila. You can also use Patron if you like Patron. I don't like Patron, but uh, the Bell is a higher shelf brand of tequila. And for this cocktail, it is ideal. So if you're gonna make this cocktail, I encourage you to use the Bell tequila or tequila. So we're gonna do two ounces of tequila. We're gonna do two ounces of our strawberry lime to kill you, or sorry, <laughs> strawberry lime bagadita mix. This does have alcohol added. I normally don't like getting margarita mixes with alcohol added, but if you get it and it hadn't been on the shelf too long, and you refrigerate it up, you open it, you should be okay. It was just the only kind I could find at the time that was the right flavor for this drink. So two ounces of the margarita mix, strawberry lime. We get some simple syrup. We're also gonna do a whole ounce of simple syrup. All right, now we're gonna get our sweet vermouth. I always keep this refrigerated until the last moment until I add it. Once you open this stuff, it starts losing its value or flavor. It ruins. If you leave it out of the refrigerator too long, it will ruin. So you wanna make sure you keep your vermouth refrigerized. We're gonna do one fourth of vermouth. Back in the fridge. Now 
Now we're gonna take us some strawberries. My strawberries are frozen. It's just the way I've always, I always keep them because they last longer that way. Strawberry there. Now, you can either slice it in the pieces and drop it in the drink, or you can slice it and use it as a garnish. I think it looks better on the side as a garnish. You can slice up another one and, and drop it in there if you like as well. But there you have it, folks. Vampire juice established here at the Man Cave on the Man Cave Experience. Every one I drink is better than the last one. This has a stronger taste than most of the beverages I've made on this channel. If you've been keeping up, most of my drinks are smoother with a more of a tropical kind of kick. This one is for those that like a, a stiff drink. If you're, you know, sitting around maybe smoking some cigars or, just, or whatnot, maybe you just like stiff drinks in general. This drink right here is very complimentary for that type of crowd. Good. Very good. There you have it folks, the vampire juice. You heard about it here first at the Man Cave Experience. All right, peeps, I hope you really enjoyed the video. I hope you got a chance to learn something as well. I know what I do on this channel is a little different from most. I don't really understand why people make videos about cocktails such as Old Fashioned, the Bees Knees, etc. You know, I'm not used to do that in the past. But anybody can make those kind of videos. Anybody can look up those recipes online. I take more pride in coming up with my own recipe, something you've never tried before, something you may have never thought of, and getting it out there to you and getting your opinion on what you think about it. These drinks that I come up with, I have manipulated and tested before I just come right out and share the ingredients. So. These are drinks that I have obviously tried out and made sure they were good before I bring them to you. But with all that being said, I really do want to thank you for taking an interest in my content. Thank you to those who have subscribed, those that have donated, and to those that have even bought some merch and things of that nature. Um, these videos, I always like to leave you with some last thoughts. And the main thing I want you to remember is that if you're going through something, there's always a better way. I prefer to use fitness as a avenue out of the darkness. And also I want you to remember if you know anybody that's going through something, such as depression or drug problems, think about killing themselves. Because as you know, if you were watch this channel a lot, Drug overdoses and suicides are some of the number one killers in our nation and both are very preventable. So you and I can do our part by being a listening ear or shoulder to cry on or a voice of advice to those that are going through something. Like I said before, I strongly believe that working out or any type of fitness and exercises can help you get a better state of mind be more self-esteem and of course you're going to be healthier happy and you're going to live better just out of a default from working out so with all that said i want to remind you one more time we have our shirts on sale the barrel growth natural fitness shirts are all on sale you can find them on our barrel growth natural fitness facebook page and our man cave experience shirts are brand new and they are currently on sale for a limited time. We will also be giving away a shirt or two sometime in October. We've done the same thing last year and uh, people seem to like it. My, me and my son's birthdays are both in October and that's why we give shirts away in October just to, just for something to do. But nevertheless, if you would like to win one of those shirts, Feel free to comment 
anything uh, if i see you commented that lets me know that you are you watch the channel and you're more likely a subscriber because i'm trying to get the shirts out to people that subscribe and we'll probably also give one out to just somebody out in the, in the public out some random person but nevertheless thank you so much for tuning in thank you for supporting the channel and i hope you and yours continue to be blessed